Hello friends, welcome to my Foam NX review. Foam NX is a drag and drop builder to make any kind of foam in minutes. Foam NX comes with thousands of ready-made templates professionally crafted to fit your purpose. So with Foam NX, you don't need any coding skill to create any type of professional looking forms. Now I am inside the simple dashboard of Foam NX and here I will provide you a small demo of the product. But before going into the demo, I like to mention that one link is given in the video description below and that is the AppSumo lifetime deal. One AppSumo lifetime deal is going on and price is $49 only. And if you come below, you can know more about the tool based for the consultants, marketers and small businesses. And you can integrate with Google Calendar, Google Sheets, MailChimp, Stripe and Webhooks. And if you come below, you can know more about the features and benefits of the product. So these are the deal terms and conditions and these are the feature details. And also they provide 60 days money back guarantee. If you don't like the product for any reason, you can return it back and they will refund your money within 60 days of your purchase. And they have some licensed tiers up to four courses are there. Plan 1, Plan 2 and Plan 3. $49, $98 and $147. So check all the features and go as per your requirement. Now again come back to the dashboard and here I will provide you a small demo of the product. So this is the dashboard and here you will get the home section. Here you will get templates and here you will see my workspaces. Manage workspaces and create workspaces. So you can start with the template and if we create form here. So click on create form. So here you can start with start from scratch. You can start from scratch. We can use one template and also use AI that is coming soon and also copy existing form. If you have any existing form, you can copy it from here. And also you can see the templates category wise. So just cross it. You can see the templates from here also. So click on templates and here you'll see all the categories like registration forms, feedback forms, customer feedback, event registration, survey forms, student registration, questionnaire forms, compliance and verification, relationship and social interactions. So these are the templates are available. You can choose any template as per your requirement. For example, I can take customer feedback. So click on customer feedback and here you will find out lot of forms like restaurants evolution form, give thanks form, daycare parent survey, then performance review, customer evolution, product market fit, customer satisfaction survey form. So these are the forms are available here. So we can choose any form like restaurant evolution form. Restaurant owners can provide this form to their customer to get the feedback from them. So you can preview the form from here. So preview it. So this is the form and here you will find out dine in, take out, food quality, overall service quality, cleanliness, order accuracy, speed of service, value. So you can use this template from here. Use the template. So give one name. For example, we can give a name like food. Also you can give one description but that is optional so create a form and here we can change everything so this is one small tour how to build the form i am skipping it right now so you can change everything like day visited so if we click on this section day visited we can change everything like if we don't want day visited instead we can write visit date So you can change this and also help text is there so you can change the help text and that will come below of the visit date and here we can write like please specify the date so it will come here the same way you can change everything like dine or take away take out so here column width is there so you can change column width if we want but i want 100 percent icon prefix so you can add on prefix so this is the prefix and also we can add the suffix maybe this one is the suffix and also start date so this is the way we can change every element so cross it now and also we can change the next one so click on this so you can change this text you can add the help text then preferred options these are the options excellent good average dissatisfied 
or you can add more like poor so you can add more options here click on this you can change everything you can change the text placeholder help text column with icon prefix suffix everything we can change default value everything we can change and now come to the elements again and if we want to add more element inside the form that is also possible maybe we can add date and time so put date and time here and if we want to keep it at the last just click on this arrow here so it will come in the last So this is the way by simply dragging and dropping you can change the position of the element if we want to add more things like number email if we want email we also add the email here so this is the email field so whenever we'll be finished with our form we can save it from here and also more things are there so come to forms here and here there are options like classic form and card form so all elements in one page and card form single element per page here we can change the name of the form here we can put the description here full size large medium small anyone you can choose and form position left center right i want center and also page settings are there form settings are there you can change these things also you can change the colors background colors you can put javascript css everything you can put here click on field condition and here you can put the conditions like show or hide hide a particular element like put quality this element will not be shown when value is equal to average so on that case this field will not be shown here so we can add the conditions here and we can add more conditions here so this is easy to add the conditions so define conditions you can add but i don't want to add any condition now so delete it and come to email section and here we can enable it we can put the form email and to email by putting the comma separate the multiple emails by using the comma and also reply to emails cc bcc subject you can put here you can put the body here we can attach the pdf file also and now come to the settings section here some settings are there like google captcha if you want enable it just enable google captcha from here and also thank you page is there so you can use thank you page form scheduling setting then password protection if you want to protect it by password you can enable it now one two three form submission reference pdf design submit button setting form data setting duplicate check and also seo setting is there and more settings are also there few more settings are also there if you want to use the progress bar you can use it you can enable it now scroll to top button if you want you can also enable it so this is easy and now come to integration section you can integrate with google sheet mailchimp webhook then stripe google calendar you can integrate with these tools and also publish at the end you can publish it this is the link of your form you can copy the link from here you can share the link and also you can open it in a new tab so open it so this is the form and also few more options are there you can share it on facebook share it on linkedin share it on twitter and also if you want the embed code just copy this embed code and you can paste it inside your website and also button is there simple button feedback button is also there so these are the things are there so see the form then so i just input something visit it maybe this day i have visited the restaurant and dine in take out so dine in excellent maybe average we can choose this average and dissatisfied maybe average or good or excellent speed of service good value average overall experience average and you can put some comment here you can put your name here and age we can put the age here and also email we can put our email here and submit the form will be submitted inside the platform and now come to my workspace so click on my workspace and leave and here we can see the form so this is the form i have created food and here we can see the submission so view the submission so only one submission and we can see it so here you can see who is submitted the form and you can see all the data here and also you can put your comment here 
you can download the PDF, you can print the PDF and also here you'll get the submission report and visitor reports and also you can view the form and also you can edit it, also delete it, copy the form and also you can publish it. So that's all about Form NX. This is an excellent tool. Definitely you can go with this tool to create your forms. One link is given in the video description below for your ready reference and that is the AppSumo lifetime deal. And if you want 10% extra discount, you can go through my link. That's all for today. If you like this video, hit the like button and also subscribe my YouTube channel. And also don't forget to hit the bell notification because whenever I publish a new video, you will be get notified instantly. So thank you for today. Bye bye.